There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Divas? So, this is kind of like really informal introduction because I really actually did um, already record the beginning, like the introduction of this hair, but I think I accidentally deleted it because I cannot find it anywhere on none of my external hard drives. Um, I have two of them, and I couldn't find it anywhere. So, I wanted to redo this again before I make this wig, but I really didn't want to go upstairs. So, the hair that I have is by The Sore Hair. And they did send me some hair. Really nice packaging, guys. Um, really simple, but it's cool because you can tell that quality and care was put into this. So it does have hair care instructions on the back of it, but it comes in a nice little box. So I did get a um, four bundles of their Brazilian straight. I did get a 24, a 22, a 20, a 24, two 22s, and a 20-inch bundles um, for those. And I did get a 20 inch middle part straight lace closure. So, four bundles 120, two 22s, a 24 inch, and a 20 inch middle part lace closure. And this is all the Brazilian straight. Okay, and so the website is thesorehair.com. Um, each of their hair comes just packaged up individually like this, and they have those little kind of like tags on them if you want to scan them. But everything is 100% human hair. So, anyway, um, so the hair smells just like, I don't know, um, to me it just smells like hair. Um, it's not really a great scent, but I'm pretty sure that once you wash it, it will, you know, wash out. But it just reminds me of hair like that you get from like AliExpress. It has that same scent to it. The weft is double weft tracks, and they're kind of long, but the hair is not as thick. So when I do four, um, when I do straight, I always need like, um four bundles because it's so thin like I think like straight hair is like super thin to me um, and especially because it's long too like I don't really do 24 inches now for me 24 22 22 and 20 is cool but I like to have two of the same for the bottom so this time I have 24 and then two 22s and a 20 I would really have preferred two 24s a 22 and a 20 because the bottom I like to be a little bit more fuller and I like it to be the same length so I'm not really sure what I did that, but, you know, it's a work around it. But this hair is, like, long, and I don't really do 24 inches because, excuse me, it's just, like, really super long, and I don't really like my hair to be that long anymore because I just feel like it doesn't look really, like, realistic, so I don't really like to do it like that. But for the most part, the hair is, like, um, it's just soft. It looks like hair for right now. I really can't tell you much about it until I start to wash it. And then as for the closure, now, the, the closure doesn't smell like the hair. It just has no scent to it, but this is the closure. Now, they said it was a middle part, but honestly, it does not look like it was tweezed at all. It just looked like it was parted. It doesn't look like it was tweezed. It, it wasn't tweezed. Actually, it wasn't tweezed. It's actually a free part closure, and they just parted in the middle. So, whatever, I would still tweeze it because I like it to, like, show partage. But the actual knots in this is really good because, look, you can actually see through this. I love when you can see through it. That means that it's ventilated real good. That's what I think. You know what I'm saying? But this is a 20 inch frontal. I never really have too many 20 inch frontals, but you know, it's cool. And it's just really nicely made. It's not wrinkled. I hate when I get them and they wrinkle. Oh, I can't stand that. And then the rest is just all packaged up. So yeah, they do have like really nice sleek packaging. It's just packaging, but some people are really like, you know, they're into the packaging and stuff. So for me, you know, it is packaging. So yes, you guys. So I'm about to get this wig made. So I will speak to you guys later. Bye. All right, you guys. So I am done with this wig. Um, I did use all of the bundles of hair that they sent me and it turned out to be really, really nice. But you guys know, I don't really like it so long. 24 inches is like a lot of hair. 
especially for the fact that they sent me 24, 22, 22, and 20, and then a 20 inch closure. I just really wanted it to kind of like all be even at the bottom. So I went ahead and trimmed the wig actually um, so that it all could be the same length. And I just flat ironed it. I'm, I want to curl it, so I'm going to put a couple of curls in it because I want to see how well it curls. But for the most part, this hair is so smooth. Like, so it has like a medium luster to it, and it just came out really, really nice. Um, the middle part, I did like tweeze a little bit, and I already put my concealer on it. And, of course, it does have the combs like always. This time I put four because, you know... I don't know. Sometimes I just put four. Sometimes I put three. It all depends on the mood that I'm in. But I put the concealer on the inside as well as on the outside. So let's go ahead and do this video and see how this wig turns out. Well, you're in the video. You want to say hi? Hi, hello. Hi. You gotta come closer. You gotta come this way. Hi. Look this way. Okay. And say hi. Hi. There you go. I Watch do. out for the hot curler. I do. No, no, the hot curler. You gotta go. Go get your um. Let me guess. I love you. Don't keep wiping my kisses up. Go get your basketball. Mm-hmm. Okay, so as you guys seen, um, for one, the hair seems a little bit hard for me to curl. Um, it just, it seems like this particular hair takes a lot to curl with. Um, so I don't really think that this would be like the best barrel to use because the curls would be so big that they would just basically fall out. Um, it is very sleek and straight. I'm not sure if it's because I flat ironed it. Normally when I have straight hair and I want to curl it, I never flat iron it first. But I really did want to see what this hair was like. But I really didn't want to do a straight hair video because I had just did one like some weeks ago. So I really wasn't trying to do like a straight hair video. But um, 
I should have just left it as it is but you still it's still good that I did flat iron so you can see that the quality is nice it doesn't look fried the ends don't look dried up or anything the hair doesn't look dried up it's just that it takes a little bit more to curl this bone straight here now for me I never curl my hair on my head as you guys know I always use my mannequin heads it makes life so much more easier um, you get the perfect curls the perfect styles and etc etc so that's why you don't see me curl a lot of hair on camera the hair is very full like I used every last four bundle when it comes to full, um, straight hair it has to be like really really like um, full for me so I always kind of like to use like four bundles it looks really nice it's very soft and smooth and I don't think like it'll tangle like that you know you can just feel something it just feels like really really good like it feels really good um, it kind of reminds me of my other wig that I had made like a few weeks ago um, except for that one was three bundles and it had and it was shorter I don't really like the hair so long anymore I just I just don't to me this is kind of like longer and I don't really like it as long anymore so I try to just keep it kind of like at for me an average length um, instead of it being like all down my backside or touching my backside I don't really want it to be that long um, and especially because it'd be so hot here I don't really want it to be so long and also because it's just less maintenance when it's so long but for the most part the sore hair they have some really nice packages as I got as I showed you guys and their quality is really great as well um, when it comes to short hair I mean straight bone straight hair the best thing that I could su suggest for you guys is always use prior to curling it, use like a styling mousse that way the hair will be so much easier to curl um, and it tames the flyaways and then brush the styling mousse thoroughly you don't have to saturate it but make it like a little bit you know moist um, I didn't have any styling mousse this is the only styling mousse that I have from the Dollar Tree and I used it as something else and trust and believe girlfriends I was not happy with it but for the most part you can check them out I will post all of their information below if they have any codes, sales, anything like that. I will definitely post it for you guys below. And you can definitely check them out on their site. And as well as that, make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Um, thumbs this video up if you love me as much as I love you guys. And if you're interested in getting a custom wig made by yours truly, then you can definitely check out my website. And I will post that down below for you guys. So on that note, stay deep and delicious. I love you guys. And I'll see y'all in a super video.